Hello Team Ropers, Helomatic, Ask the Pro Tips with Chad Mathis. This week I want to talk about stiffness of ropes. Okay? I had a guy come last week, I helped him with his roping. He was having trouble getting his bottom strand under the feet and keeping the top strand high enough so the steer didn't kick it over or he didn't, you know, he a lot of times when you come through, if it's too low, it won't have enough, it won't have enough through on it and it'll wave off the feet. Okay, so what I had him do was I, I had a couple of mediums. He was using a medium soft, and I bumped him up to a medium, and, and I got him to where he could get that top strand to hit higher and get the bottom to come under because the rope was more open. Okay, it's more important, it's more important when you heal to have the rope flank to the ground, okay, than it is to have a rope that you can that you really think you can swing well, okay? I don't, these are all medium hards, that's what I use. I don't necessarily like swinging a medium hard. I would rather swing an extra soft magnet or something if I had my choice, but I don't have the success healing that I do with the medium hard because with the medium hard, when my rope hits, when my, when my top strand hits up here, the bottom is down and coming under. So it's it, the rope is the, the top strand hits up here high, the bottom comes under. Then when it kicks up, the rope kicks up and stays above their hocks. Okay, see how the rope is above his hocks. Okay, with your with your with your softer ropes, I think a lot of times what happens what hap what was happening to this guy is the bottom that there's there's the same thing has to happen whether it's whether it's the bottom goes under both feet like this or whether you set a trap and the steer jumps over the bottom. One of the two has to happen. The bottom has to be down. So when you've got an when you've got a medium soft heel rope, and you know some ropes run softer than others, some medium softs are probably stiff enough. But when you've got a medium soft heel rope, and when you're swinging it, it's only this wide, okay, and you come down like this, the bottom has to go under. So the top strand hits really low. Well, what happens when the top strand hits really low and hits below those hocks is it comes through. Okay, now, if I wasn't in perfect time, if I wasn't in perfect time, the steer can whip it down. Okay? And I think that's what happens to a lot of guys. I think the soft ropes feel really good to swing, but I think guys get confused on their, guys and gals, get confused on their delivery because they have to have it hit so low. All right? I try to get my top strand... I try to swing my tip right through those two hocks on this roping dummy right here. Okay, my tip is going right through, right above where the legs bend, and it, and therefore when I come down and through, I'm going to try to put the top strand right there because I want the top of this rope when it curls around, I want it to be above those hocks. And there's less chance of it. There's less chance of it being able to fall or drop off if I get it high. Now that being said, if I try to take my medium soft heel rope, if I try to take my medium soft heel rope that I that I've got that I'm swinging and it's only this wide from the top to the bottom strand, if I'm trying to get it to hit up here, there's no way that I can get it to go under his feet. Okay. And so you're, you're, you've got a double-edged sword there. You've got, you've got to try to get the bottom under, but the top's not high enough. But if you want to try to get the top high enough, you can't get the bottom under, okay? There's a reason why we use, why, why we use stiff ropes to heal with. It's, it's, not because, it's not because we're throwing them hard. It's not because uh, we're trying to get them to do something special that a hard rope does and a soft rope doesn't. It's we're trying to get the rope as open as it can be from top to bottom when it comes through, okay? I personally don't think you should use anything less than a medium to heal with, okay? You might have to use something lighter. If your arm doesn't like to swing a big heavy rope, you might have to go to a lighter rope, but when you heal, try to play with the stiffer ropes a little bit and see how you get along. Next week's video is going to be on something that I think is pretty important, and I'm still trying to put my thoughts all the way together on it, but I think a lot of people have trouble transitioning from the ground dummy to the horse, and I've got some thoughts and some things that I've come up with that have really helped me over the past six months, so stay tuned till next week. Try stiffer ropes to heal with, all right? You don't have to go out and buy medium hards, but if you're, if you're, at, a, if you're at a medium soft, try to step up to at least a medium, maybe even a medium hard and see how you get along.
We'll see you next week.